Fellow Dreamers, in today's video I'm participating in another collab. This collab is hosted by Jamie from Board or Bananas and I will link her channel in the description bar below. We're doing a look for less. So we're basically trying to find inspiration from somewhere, whether it's a store or something online, something on Pinterest, and recreating that look for less money. The stuff that I got, I'm actually trying to recreate items that are inspired by restoration hardware slash pottery barn and I'm going to be taking scary items from the Goodwill like so and turning them into something that you might see at those two stores for a lot less money than buying it there. So let's go check it out. So I spent about $20 at my Goodwill and I picked up a couple of really terrifying looking cardinals. This is a salt shaker owl, which I thought was pretty cute, but hopefully nobody knows it's a salt shaker. And then I got a basket, a terrifying looking owl, a vase, and some potpourri, and some greenery. I guess it's called greenery. It's not green, but it's close. And then I went to the Meyer right next door, and I picked up some spray paint for just a couple dollars. This was kind of a teal blue color, and then I got a cream color. So after spray painting, this is what it looked like. So much nicer, right? That plate actually came from another part of my house. It was originally black and red, and so I spray painted it white. But take a look at this bird. It's so much nicer now that it's a white color. So for the potpourri, that's why I got the basket to put it in. Um, it's actually not scented. It came with scented type oil potpourri stuff that was so artificial smelling it gave me a headache. So there was no way that I was going to keep those little bottles. So I decided to make an imitation Williams Sonoma scent, which is a combination of rosemary, lemon, and I'm using Stress Away essential oil um, it, because it has vanilla in it. And so I'm using five drops each. Now if you guys are interested in essential oils, I have a class coming up on Tuesday, March 1st. So um, if you're interested in signing up for that class, the link will be in the description bar below and you can learn all about essential oils. And this combination smells absolutely heavenly. So here's the before, this is my mantle. I have nothing on it <laughs> at all. And here's the after, how about that? So it looks actually, I think, pretty good. I think it looks a little bit better in real life than it does on video. Um, those candlesticks I just had in another part of my house, so I threw those in there, put a salt lamp on there as well. There's the spray painted vase and the greenery kind of things, and the spray painted birds, the potpourri in the middle, more spray painted birds, and a spray painted plate on the end. I think it looks really nice. I mean, you know, compared to what it looked like before, this is totally something you would see at least, if not at Restoration Hardware, at like maybe World Market or at Michael's or Marshall's, any of those places. I think it turned out pretty good. Thank you guys so, so much for hanging out with me today. Like I said earlier in the video, I am hosting an Essential Oils 101 class on Tuesday, March 1st at 10 a.m. Eastern time on Facebook. So if you're interested in figuring out how to use these things we call essential oils, um, the link to the class will be in the description bar below. You can just go there and sign up. If you haven't already and you'd like to, hit that button down below, subscribe so you never miss a Daily Dreamland video. Kiss the one you love today, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Ciao.